even there was a rock, dude. That's in there. <laughs> you just go. I didn't even oh. notice. Oh, oh. oh they get it out. Oh. They get it out. Why not? Keep, Why not? Keep it. Keep it. Not you, dude. Not you. I, 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 I got it. I got it. I got it. I got it. Take it out. It's a pull it. Pull it. Oh. Oh. Dude, you're gonna be Spider-Man tomorrow. Oh, oh you're gonna turn into a cactus, oh. dude. Oh. He's a oh. cactus oh. man. You're a cactus oh. man. This is our aerobic threshold, not our anaerobic threshold. Duration's better in this, okay? So I'd rather get more laps at a slower pace. Let's just get a baseline for this workout. We'll do this four times, okay? So we got three more of these. Big difference when the temperature comes down. So let's just get a baseline with this, a good starting point. That's all we want today. Homeboy, you go four miles? Can I see how I feel like at two? Yes. Okay. Yes. Just remember that that hill may make you feel like... Yeah, like crap at this point. Yeah. Crap would be an understatement. If you could just feel like crap, that'd be great. For most of you guys, what we're going to do is target uh, yeah, 11 to 11.10, something like that on the first loop. Um, and then, uh, yeah, just kind of let you, let you go from there. So the... For that, like what we're looking for is, a, is its feel, right? So take into account that it's warm, uh, it's early, things like that. So I don't, let's have the numbers be what the numbers are at the end as long as we're kind of keeping in that aerobic effort. When I was just telling, uh, telling Drew this, like aerobic effort in relevancy to Buffalo Park is uh, someone put that, you know, 30 meter hill in the middle of this. So aerobic effort after this hill is all in, in kind of relativity to it, right? So it's, you're gonna be anaerobic coming off that hill. But we wanna have big group presence for these workouts. So yes, your role in this is, you know, execute today, but like, let's go head on to the warm down today feeling like we had a great team workout today, right? Because if, you know, we, we go into Wisconsin and uh, we get started off on that day with that B race, those guys having a great race. We know we, we race really well that next race. Okay, so big team mentality in everything that we're doing. So let's just have a good team workout today, all right? Awesome. Um, Jimmy, Bo, and uh, Landley, I'm going to have you guys in the, um, in the uh, 540 to 550 range. So just let, these, let the rest of these guys go just a dash. I want everyone else um, trying to be in the 11, 11 O's, something like that. Right. Cool. Want any questions? All right, sweet. Have a good session. What's that? This one um, in particular, it's, it's on paper, it's not real glamorous, but this is to me what is going to make the difference uh, on the second half of a long distance cross country race, right? Particularly the distance from 8K to 10K. We want to be uh, moving oxygen so well that we can handle um, these faster paces and we can be there to compete late, okay? So all those teams out there that are dreading the difference from 8K to 10K, that's actually where, that's our office. That's where your desk and your chair is. That's where you go to work.
nice getting back out there with a big group. I think some of the, some of the boys have been doing a couple over the summer, um, but first one for me, first workout of the season, and uh, yeah, just nice to be back with a big group. this thing of like harder is better it's like you want to find that sweet spot of just like just on that line and maintainable How's that, Louise? Oh, I felt great, yeah. Um, well, it looks a little bit tired, mileage, you know, but other than that, I uh, made the best of the workout today. We have tired legs, but yeah, it was good running with the boys again and uh, all working together and running as a team rather than individuals. So I'd say it was a great day for first Buffalo Park of the season for sure. That felt pretty good today. That was like pretty much my best sub tee that I've ever done. Um, I don't think, I don't know, I don't know if I've ever done eight before, maybe like one other time. I know I've done seven, but every other time it was like hovering right above like 5.30 and around there, you know? So uh, going, going like from 5.30 down into like the 5.20s, like low, felt pretty good. Uh, I guess that was just uh, doing 100 mile weeks all summer and stuff. But uh, um, the whole team, like that was, that was awesome. Going six or going, having that many people go six like that fast and like working together really well and stuff. Uh, that was really exciting. Like last year around this time we would have like, you know, usually something kind of like that, like a group trying to run like that, but that was like the most people being able to kind of move off at 5.30 and like just feel good and be pretty smooth. So yeah, that was good. Two years ago, there was a really big sub T where like, I feel like eight or nine dudes went like 5.30 pace for like eight miles or something like that, seven or eight miles. And like, we were just ecstatic about that. And we just had a bunch of guys able to do that like in the first week. So we'll feel, <laughs> I'm really excited about that. Oh, dude, you can't even see it. I would, I would lay on I that. would lie on that as well. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Oh. I was just trying to get it to move. It's tarantula. Right, yeah, dude, you can't even see yeah, it. It was nice. even more camouflage right there. Dude, that's scary. Look at him. No, you definitely have to do that to that. Is that definitely a tarantula? It doesn't yeah. look like one. No, they are. Ooh, I like that tarantula. They're so skinny. Right, let's yeah. get him on his way. Let's get him out of this area. Come on, little guy. Gentlemen, that was a, a great starting point for us. Uh, I like the emotional energy. We weren't too hype. It was just solid, steady. That's where we want to be right this time of year. Let's just get this work in. One of the things that's hard to decipher is like your evaluation based on how it feels. So I'm interested in how it feels. I don't want you to read too much into how it feels. All right. Let's just get this work in. It was it was warm for a sub T. Uh, we got a nice starting point. Um, that that same effort in October translates to much bigger numbers. So I, I loved where we were. I like seeing our group uh, our group stick together and people looking out for each other. So um, quick turnaround for tomorrow morning, right? So tonight's important, just taking really good care of yourself and uh, eat, sleep, and be refocused on that on that run tomorrow. Okay. All right, sweet. And then uh, Corey, Drew, Caleb, welcome to Buffalo Park. Yeah. All right, see you guys. Great first sub-threshold for us. Uh, it was warm, and we had guys going as far as eight miles, so that was that was impressive. We're uh, when we do these, we're just watching to make sure the effort is where we want it. So listening to breathing, uh, and just making sure that they're doing this and not turning it into a different workout than it's supposed to be, uh, keeping at the right effort. So that was uh, what they did today. Mission accomplished.
uh, good energy, right? Like we don't we don't want them too hyped too early, and so we just really try to downplay uh, what we're trying to do and keep the energy low. Uh, they got the job done. It's perfect.